Greetings, friends out there. This is Peter and Camilla Olman on the To Be Continued Network. Yes. And we want to make a New Year's video for you guys and uh, to just get, keep you updated what's going on, what's been happening this year, and also a little bit what's going to happen next year. And we also have a very strong prophetic message for you, uh, proph prophetic encouragement, but also prophetic warning that we'll uh, share in the ending of this video. Uh, and also, if you want to have uh, read more detail what's going on, you can go into our uh, website. You can see the, the link below, uh, to be continued.nu. There we have the latest newsletter. Yes, the latest, latest newsletter. Uh, so, um, uh, it's been an exciting year, Camilla. Yes, yeah. uh, I think it started in, uh, was it Bolivia? Yes, mm -hmm. yeah. So in February this year we were in Bolivia and then we went to Poland and then to the States, to America and then we went to Spain and... Um, and then we've been in Sweden. And we've been in Sweden a lot <laughs> and doing a, a lot of things and I think some of you are familiar with the gemstone training. Mm -hmm. We have been uh, uh, modeling that in different ways in mm -hmm. people's lives and uh, we had seminars, we had trainings, mm -hmm. we were working together with other networks in house church movements. Yes. And uh, we started a house church in uh, Poland yes. with Mario, uh, Marek and uh, Maja. Yes. And they're, they're doing a great job over there. And, and Larry and Leslie in, in, in the States. And we have uh, a lot of things going on in Bolivia. Yes. Uh, and also Spain with Samir Rachel. Yes. Great disciples mm. of Jesus. Mm. They started up, uh, uh, we started something with them in France. And it's been growing a lot during the years with house churches, networks. And they're going, uh, they're in Spain now. Yeah. Um, having uh, their hearts when it comes to a base camp. Yeah. Mm. So, so, so it's, it's uh, exciting times and uh, we are very happy to be a part of it. And uh, we also uh, want to thank you out there that have been a, being a part of it in different ways. Yes, we want to thank you for praying with us, mm. for working together with us yes. and continuing when we have been equipping you and especially also you that have been standing with us when it comes to the finances. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. You have a part of what we are doing. Absolutely. What we do, you have a part of also. And uh, we, are re we are really excited also about next year now because uh, when the, in the beginning of the last year, uh, this year, it's going to be the last year tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 2023, tomorrow. Uh, but in the beginning of 2022, we, went, we were invited to Bolivia. And mm. uh, I think it was more than we expected there. Yes. We went mm. into a, a huge prison called the Palma Sola prison. And it's basically, it's around between 5,000 and 8,000 prisoners. They don't really know how many without uh, police or guards inside. Mm. It's a very dangerous place, a dark, uh, place and dark place. But we went in there and God really moved there. With signs and wonders, miracles, people came to Christ, we baptized people. And they wanted to invite us back uh, again. Mm. And uh, so now we actually are going into Bolivia. Bolivia again now in the beginning of uh, 2023 mm. and you will see much more about that and also to continue the trainings we did, did outside the prison yes with pastors uh, uh, we disciple people have seminars uh, and they really they were they said something I think Mar brother Marcos they said something like this Peter this has revolutionized Bolivia we have never heard something like this before can you imagine when you share the real gospel truth God moves. So we're very excited about that also, how to do that. And then we have some other plans also for Germany and other countries. And, and I think also, Camilla, we have learned by Dune Journey. Mm -hmm. uh, if we share too much what's going on in the future before, mm -hmm. we also give uh, the enemy a heads up. So yeah, seen we that. don't want to do that. No, no. So we have seen <laughs> that. A lot of attacks come before yes. we go. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we, um, we are trying to not tell too much before we are taking the next step. Mm -hmm. And not because it's secret uh, to you guys out there who are following Christ, but there is a lot of people that are not following Christ, but also mm -hmm. those that don't like when the, the kingdom of God is expanding. And we have something very exciting uh, to, to share with you guys. We are moving. Yes, God told us to actually move from the place we live right now in Uppsala and uh, we've been living there for a long time. And now we're moving to another place uh, to mobilize. And there is reasons also we do that. Yes, yeah, so I think you got a prophetic message. Yes, yeah, so and, and, and this morning I was praying and God really amp uh, amplified that message. But And he said to me, he spoke to me and said that, there is coming a great tribulation now, even more than it has been over the world, and a lot of needs, uh, needs among the, the believers. And, uh, and God is now mobilizing his people to meet those needs, both spiritually but also physically, in different locations around the world. 
and uh, and uh, God, uh, I just now understand more why God is moving us also. Mm. So this, I think, this is a very important uh, 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 message from God, and also a warning uh, uh, for the world. And the other thing he he spoke to me this morning was that this com- there's coming now a great falling away from Christ. Mm. Uh, some people will claim they're believers, Christians, followers of Christ, but they will actually sort of compromise more and more now with the world mm. to adapt into worldly systems, uh, agree with things that are not from God, and so on. But there will be be those that don't want to be uh, doing that, and mm. they actually have this. That's the reason God is creating these groups now mm. and mobilizing these base camps yes. around the world mm. uh, to be a provider for God's people to be able to stand. Yes, and I got this uh, word that I want to encourage you with. Uh, that is that uh, uh, I want to wish you shalom. I want to wish you mm. peace, uh, and peace means uh, to complete, to make whole, to be one. Um, so um, God wants you to have peace in mm. all areas, in the relationships and in your life, in the church. So when this tribulation comes, mm. he wants us to have peace. So I wish you peace. Shalom. Yeah. God bless you guys out there. A happy 2023 new year. And as usual, to, to be, be continued. continued.